What? Is it's Fresh Fish Friday? <laughs> Chuck, today's a sad day. Today is a sad day in the day of Fresh Fish Fridays. Oh, I was thinking it was sad because it's Good Friday of the day our Lord and Savior died, but yeah, there was fish sandwiches too. Oh, oh God! God! Oh, 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 she's in the middle! Someone's gonna not make it! Well, that just happened. Sorry. He just set I some lady up to get in the middle. No, I'm sure it wasn't because we were making a feature YouTube video oh, man. on Fresh Fish that you caused someone to have an accident. <laughs> so, I... No, uh, it is our last Fresh Fish Friday. It's our fri last Fish Friday. If she pulls up next to me right now, oh gosh, there she is. She's going to be mad at us. She's going to be right. mad at us. Oh, oh, she's behind us. Oh, man. Are you <laughs> kidding me? Okay. No, I got nervous. No, I had the right of way, right? When, you, when you're at an intersection, the person going right always has the right of way. Sounds like privilege to me. She was... <laughs> I didn't say the white of way. Um, so... <laughs> <laughs> this is too good. So, Can we extend Lent? Yeah. Call um, the Catholics. So <laughs> call the Pope. Hey, he could do that. You know, you can become Pope. If you become Catholic, anybody that's Catholic can become Pope. I thought you had to be like Italian or French or German or something. Catholic. So you go through, and I learned this from an Nate Bargatze. Do podcast. you have to? Do you have to politic? I don't know. But I couldn't read all the stuff. So, it is raining uh, on a Fresh Fish Friday, which is Pepper unprecedented. Bomb. Yes. So, this is our last Fresh Fish Friday. I'm awfully sad about it. We're going to go someplace that we've never been before. Well, not for one of these videos. So, <laughs> I, I, can, I want to tell you something that I'm excited about. You fine folks are going out and visiting the establishments that we visit for Fresh yeah. Fish Friday. Last week, Burger Bank, they should be giving us money because several of you went yeah. to the Burger Bank. Yeah, we need to have some sort of and affiliate program or did something. Did it cost you that much money? Because we got two fish sandwiches and two fries. It was 20 bucks. And I think I think they mischarged us. because He charged us extra because like, that's, the, that's the filming fee. But I will say I did write them on Facebook and said, hey, can we use you in our video? And he said, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Oh, he, did? he didn't even see the video first. He didn't know we trapped him or not. I love those people. I know. They Burger were... Bank is like on the list of favorites. Yeah. I... Okay. So where we're we going today, Chris? We're going to the king of all burgers. King of all burgers. So we're not going there for burgers. We're going there for fresh fish. I, I think next year our feature should be we just go to burger places to get fish. We just go to burger places to get fish. Who, I who's your like burger? That. Who's burger your bank? Who's your burger? Burger King. Who's your burger? Who's your burger? So who's your burger? Going to or burger. Who's your burger? We're going to Burger King. Burger King. To get that Fresh Fish Friday. Bah, bah, bah. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Over the pandemic, I started going to Burger King more. Yeah. Because they had the best deals. They did have a lot of deals, and you found some of those deals on their app. So it, it was it was five bucks for two croissant witch meals. So I would take my daughter. Oh, I love croissant witches. I ate those croissant witches when I was in high school. There's a Burger King attached to a attached to a BP gas station, and you're missing the drive-through. I am because I got to check my app for deals. <laughs> I can't, I'm not paying full price for a, a fresh fish, fish sandwich when you have an opportunity to skirt the system. So what we're gonna have to do now is we're videoing this on Chris's iPhone. So we're gonna have to take the phone so out of than our phone. Ri I hate you. <laughs> our phone rigging. So he can look for deals. All right, see you. Right, wait, hold on, hold on. Well, gosh. Before we order, you so, can't produce and be in the film. You're, you're paying this week, and so people were mad last week because I said, "What pairs with this?" He listed 40 things, and we just got fries. They're like, "You had so many options," and so this week, whatever they say pairs well with it, Chuck has to buy it because you stipped me two weeks in a row, made me buy. So. So whatever they say pairs well with it, we're doing it. This is not Dave Ramsey budget approved. <laughs> yeah, neither was 20 bucks for two fish sandwiches and fries. All right. We'll see what happens. Oh, yeah. We'll see what happens. And you're getting it all. I'll be like, Do yes. you know what pairs well with it? A family pack. Yes, is the answer. All right. All right. All right, here we go. We are getting ready to get into the drive-thru. Beat that car. Beat that truck. Beat what? that truck. Beat that truck. No, don't beat that truck. Don't beat that truck. They're breathing you. Yeah, good. Oh, are they being nice? They're being... Well, you're... I already made... Almost he waved you on. Okay. So, they had no deals. They had no deals, but they have the big fish that I saw, and the description was great. 
Burger King does a fantastic job with two things in their app. One, photos. Photographs, high quality, make the food look delicious, and they're, also good descriptions. They're descriptors. They had sweet tartar sauce and tangy pickles. So sweet, tangy, they're playing it up, they're doing it. Brioche bun. How do you say Brioche. 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 Oh, you gotta do the, yeah, the brioche. Brioche bun. <laughs> you can't do it with your hand. I had a brioche bagel for I'm breakfast. I'm going to turn well, people want to know that you're going to the line now, so obviously. All right, so. There's a bunch of people in front of us. I, I would say Wendy's Spicy Chicken, not Wendy's, Burger King Spicy Chicken, one of my faves. Because I, I. It's delicious. I shouldn't like Burger King as much as I do, but I'm like, why didn't I find this sooner? Like, I, I used to think Burger King is like, I'll keep a Burger King cup at least a week. At least a week. You know what that reminds me of as well? How those of you who used to go to Chili's. Chili's, Chili's baby, baby back, back ribs, ribs barbecue, barbecue sauce. sauce. Chili's was one of those places. I love Chili's. <laughs> was one of those places that you often didn't think about, but whenever you went there, you were like, "Why don't I hang out with these people more often?" Chili's was my favorite. Kind of like we hang out with your family. I forget about them all the time, but then I finally hang out with them, and it was great, right? Not always. My family? Why are you talking about my family? Oh my gosh, you're the worst. Um, hey. Chris and I were thinking about this. We were thinking about doing some reviews on spicy chicken sandwiches. Spicy chicken sandwiches. I love a spicy chicken sandwich. I do too. I like hot chicken. So, so do, uh, leave a comment. Should leave we, a comment. Should we continue these videos, or is it like you know what? These seven weeks. Uh, I, that's all I can handle, you idiots. Because a lot of times when they try to make a sequel to a movie, it's not nearly as good. Like it's Home Alone enough. Seven was oh, just fan horribly. Hi, how are you? I'm doing great. What can I get for great. you today? Uh, can I have two of the the big fish sandwiches? Okay. And what what pairs well with that? Um, onion ring. All right. I'll do uh, an onion ring. Okay. And two glasses of water. One for it, please. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. You got off easy. I got off easy. Wait, I have number one. Onion ring number thing. one, I love onion rings. Fantastic. One of my favorite sides. Really? Oh, I love onion rings. Love them. Give me your money because I'm not paying for this week. I mean, we'll just see what happens when we get up there. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna slap You're the one who has to awkwardly sit there and not give that fine lady <laughs> some money. Sweet cash. Some sweet cash. All right. For our sweet tartar sauce and tangy pickles. All right, I'm gonna get my wallet out. We'll see you in just a minute. All right, Chuck. Here's the thing. We ordered two fish sandwiches. It was five bucks because it's a mix and match. It was a real five bucks, not like the taco place that gave us six bucks. My microphone just fell off. <laughs> this this set is so jury rigged right now. Everything's fine, people. <laughs> Everything's. I fine. can't imagine anything going wrong with this setup. So, control my car. Oh, let me it's take my seatbelt off. Yeah. So. We get up there. Yeah. Chuck, being the high roller that he is, has a hundred dollar bill. You shut up! Don't tell me about my money. <laughs> and we said, hey, "Can you? Can we pay with a hundred dollar bill?" Can you break this hundo? The guy looks around, takes out his wallet, his own wallet, <laughs> unzipped. It had a zipper pulls on it. Pulls it out. Pulls out Zip a wad of twenties. Counts out five. And we're like, "Wait!" And he's like, "I'm the I'm your bank today or something." What I got you. <laughs> I got you. He's like, "I'm not buying your lunch, but here's your." And so he <laughs> takes made the hundred out of his own money. So, and then we got five bucks. This was this was a deal. All right, let's bust it out. Oh, Come sorry, on, sorry. Are we doing this? Yeah. And the thing is, you asked for a certain type of zesty sauce from these people. Oh yeah. They and she's like, zesty. I already got you. It's in the bag. It's in there. I was like, they know Chris Shadow. <laughs> they know me. You gotta have that zesty sauce with the onion rings. You do. Okay. All right, let's onion this is ring mine. first. Let's just come on. Come on. ring me. Put a ring on it, Chris. I don't want that. I want to feed you. Wait, do we zesty sauce it? No. That's a good onion ring. I'm telling you, this place this is great. All right. I like onion rings. Here's a well wrapped fish sandwich. Oh gosh. That's my favorite part of these videos. What? Oh, did I still act surprised by it? Yeah. Well, I gave us one zesty. So no you put the good. onion rings in a way that I can't get my drink out. Sorry. Don't restrict my movements. All right. Okay. Wrap this. Oh. Oh. Oh, lettuce just fell out, so that's a good sign. Okay. When lettuce falls out, you know it's a good sandwich. Oh man. 
It's still square. Wait, look at the top of the bun. Show them the top of the bun. Miyoshi! It's got little marks it's on it. It's got grill marks. It's got grill marks on the bun. Look at that. Grill mark bun. Okay. There's your two pickles. Okay, I will say, well, it doesn't look quite as good as the picture did. Yeah, it never does. We like, man, I'm telling right. you, McDonald's, when they like your pictures, you're like, this looks so good. Whenever I take pictures of the food that I'm cooking for Ashley for dinner, it always looks like that it's when good. she gets home. All right. Ready? I don't like touching your food. Oh, don't! All right, here we go. Gosh, that's gross. Okay. Okay. The bun. Mm hmm. Is my favorite part. The bun's the best part. It's a sweet bun. It's a sweet bun. And for, for it to be called the big fish, I was expecting a bigger fish patty. I, I was too. I thought it was going to be larger. The fish patty does not take up all of the space of the bun. And then the picture, like I said before, it did. Mm -hmm. the, the crunch of the sandwich is pretty good because, is it panko? It's panko fish. Panko is that game that they play on The Price is Right. That's Punko. Plinko. That's Plinko. Plinko. Bing, bing, bing. Mm -hmm. um, but it's Panko. Wait, we decided last year that Panko is not a fish. What is this? Flounder? Cod? Alaskan Pollock? Alaskan Pollock. And it, it's got Panko. Panko encrusted. Panko encrusted. I'm eating my sandwich upside down. I gotta flip it. You guys ever eat your sandwiches upside down? Sometimes I do. I was okay. saying, the I just got some pickle. This is good. Mm -hmm. the, it's a good combination. Mm. The the dill the tangy pickle. Mm -hmm. I just had a bite with all three. Mm. They have good pickles. It's a good pickle. Do you know it's had good pickles? Chilies. Chilies. They're fried pickles. Chilies had great pickles. Or just the regular pickles that were on the side with your meal. Very good. They're homemade hot cream pickles. I like this. This is a really good sandwich, actually. I appreciate. The pairing of the onion rings. I like onion rings. Good pairing. It was good. So, Chris, how would you rank this? This would probably be number three. So, I would go, my, my favorite was where we were last week, Burger Barn. Burger Bank. Not the barn, bank. Followed by Freddy's. I think Freddy's is my second. Okay. This would be third. Taco John's would be fourth, that fish taco. And then Long John Silver's. Long John Silver. Oh, Long John Silver's was good too, though. No, it wasn't. I think. Yeah, it was. We, we they had the hoagie bun. Nah, not really. I feel like the salmon taco threw it off for me because it had an identity crisis. You didn't eat the salmon taco. You had the other one. I did. I took a bite of it. Um, you didn't take a bite of my salmon taco. Oh, you're right. I didn't. So then, uh, and then McDonald's. Wait, 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 we're missing one in there, aren't we? No. Yeah, rallies. The sea monster. The sea monster. <laughs> Lives. Let me forget that. So okay, they all kind of just what, run together in my head. What was I your can first? My first. Did you do, do top three? Top three. I liked Burger Barn Bank, the Bank Barn. Burger the Barn burgers. Bank. Oh, that was pretty good. I like the uniqueness of it because it wasn't your typical fast food drive-through. I appreciate that. The personality, the fantastic staff. Really, <laughs> really good there. <laughs> Um, and then you know what? I'm a <laughs> joke to that. Yeah. Almost spewed. Um, Taco John's. I know it's a taco. Then it's not a fish sandwich. So but that was my favorite. Then Taco John's? Yes. 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 All right. Okay. There you have it. The top top fish sandwich of the year. Burger Bank. Happy Good Friday, everybody. Uh, Bethel, you guys have a service mm -hmm. at... 6.30. 6.30. 6.30. 30. Um, I don't know what time the One Life one is. Check onelifechurch.info. It. Uh, it's at the West Campus at, I think it's 5. I should know this. Um, or you can just not look up anything on your own and come to Bethel. Yeah, so um, go to a Good Friday service. Yeah, Enjoy. go somewhere. Uh, we, we do make a lot of jokes on here and stuff, but we we are we're in favor of the resurrection <laughs> and why we celebrate Easter. We uh, get a but, vote? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's the top fish. In one, favor of it. The one Jesus made on the shore for the disciples after his resurrection. So, um, <laughs> Jesus. No, but, but go go eat a fish sandwich, go to a Good Friday service. Have a happy Easter, everybody. And uh, if you want us to continue making videos, uh, tell us that. We won't listen. Hot chicken. So, hot chicken. I want some hot chicken. Spicy chicken. Spicy chicken.
And some gas station chicken I've heard is pretty good. No. I don't know, it was a Christmas present. From whom? <laughs> My mother-in-law. It's a sticky thing so you can put your phone on it and stuff. What's your mother-in-law's name? Linda. Thanks, Linda. I call her Mom Junior. I think I put this here. I sign her up for magazines with the name Mom, Mom Junior. You know what? We haven't been to Los Provos in a while, but I used to put in Dave Schwambach's phone number for any reward program that I go to. Any. Okay. Well, it's falling. Okay, turn that off because I, I don't want 20 minutes of this.